Hello. It's me. I just rediscovered my camera, and I have decided that I will take a video of each day for the rest of summer. So yeah, right now I am reading my barista book. Home barista. I'm in the chapter of espresso, so maybe tomorrow I'll share a video of me making an espresso. See you later. Bye. Hi, it's me again. And my mom. Yeah, I'm recording. So, I just dropped off my postal service to Allison, so it'll begin that on Saturday. And then I picked up two of my new barista books. The Barista Book, A Coffee's Lover's Companion with Brewing Tips of Over 50 Recipes, and Coffee, The Home Barista Guide to Making the Perfect Cup. So hopefully I will become a perfect barista after this. Although, my French press that I tried to do today, uh, it wasn't, it didn't go exactly as planned. I used the frother instead of the French press. Uh, How was it once you put it in the But press? once I put it through the French press, it, it didn't, it was actually pretty good. Yeah. But, yeah, let's get back to you soon. Alright, where, where are we at? What's it sound? Crete. We're in Crete. Oh. We're about to go to the Edge Coffee Shop. It's a really cute coffee shop. Alright, so we just came out of um, the Edge. Got our coffee. My Mar iced Americano and mom got chai. iced chai and we were talking about how I've been reading a lot of barista books and they took my information and might call me in to show me how they do their roasting process, which is exciting. Uh, we got some blends here, Peru, and if it says, so if it says organic and fair trade, that means that um, none of the workers have been, like, they're against their will, or, like, they get paid equal amounts and stuff like that. And then organic, it means, obviously, there's no preservatives or not preservatives, uh, chemicals. chemicals in it, like pesticides and uh, stuff like that. Herbicides. Um, fun little story. So I got some beans from Guatemalan at a international shop in Cincinnati when I was there. And I haven't used them until I got home. Now, it says that the beans are green on the package, and I was just like, maybe that's the type of bean that they used. So I grinded them up, and then I brewed them and everything, and it was absolutely horrible. After reading my barista book, it turns out that the beans needed to be roasted, which I didn't know. And so I threw away that whole pack of beans that cost me so much because they were imported. I thought they just expired. No, I just had to roast them. So now they look like I they know have a white, white cap. Yeah, but that's that's what I mean. That's what we just saw some beans in the roaster at the Edge Cafe. I mean, that's what they look like too. So, yeah, nothing was wrong with them. We just thought they were bad. But they were. But yeah, now we know. Now I can, hopefully we'll learn how to roast at this coffee shop. And I will become the best barista ever! Alright, talk to you later. Bye. Hello! It's me again. Today we're going to the beach. It's Friday! What day is it? June 27th? Gotta check, gotta check. June 28th. And it's supposed to be, yesterday it said 91, but today it's saying a high of 89. But still, great beach weather. It's looking a little cloudy out there. But I got my sunnies, I got my hat. So does Rachel. There's Rachel. 
Rachel and her sunny. And there's mom. She has her hat back there and we have all our other beach toys and coolers and chairs. We only have two chairs? Oh, Rachel has to sit on the beach. And then we're going to go to Panini, Panini to get some sandwiches. We only brought some strawberries and drinks. And then, yeah, we might go to a U-Pick and pick some raspberries and strawberries. And then afterwards, go to the discount mall. Keep you guys updated. Bye. Here we are at the beach. Yay. Life is good. Life is good. Here's my croc madam from Panini Panini. We got a whole little set up here. Yay! Have my little window to look out of. Hello, it's me again. Um, we, we came back from a walk. Only like a, what, 25 minute walk? Found some driftwood. This could be a good sign. rock collecting. I got some, found two pieces of green sea glass. I've been collecting some uh, mustard yellow rocks and some like marble looking rocks. Hopefully I can do a project with those. Got some other sea glasses. main sea glass that I usually find is the, the brown sea glass. Because sea glass is just glass that is been washed over a bunch of times to make it smooth around the edges and so there's no sharp pain. Yeah, it's been a great day. It's rained in Chicago and but it hasn't hit us. The sun is behind the cloud right now but it still means that we're getting a UV rays so yeah. Talk to you later. Hello, it's me. We're in the car again. Mom's still driving. But this time we have Dan in the front seat. Hello. Woot woot. We're on our way to Canton, Illinois for my aunt's who... So my mom's brother's wife. Her parents are celebrating their 50th anniversary. So we're going to drive down there. We live in Canton, Illinois. And we got them this cool bird bath, bird bath thing. That's the stem and then the top is underneath the blanket. But we're going to go down there. They don't know yet. Mom tricked, tricked my uncle into saying, oh, we don't know if we're going or not. So I'm going to go surprise them and have a fun time. It's supposed to be 90 degrees. Got my hair up. Got my romper on, and my sandals, yeah, ready for, we're here for a good time, not a long time. Wait, what is it, what is the thing? I think it's we're here for a good time, not a long time, something like that. Yeah. Bye. First stop of the trip, and we went to Artie's. I got <laughs> I got a barbecue chicken sandwich, some curly fries, and a drink. And I didn't get a straw because I got my metal straw. Mom's enjoying her chicken tenders and Dad's enjoying his quarter pounder. Yummy. On to Canton. Two more hours. <laughs> I don't get these things. You see, I get them. I don't know how to get them. I know. All I do is. Turn on Facebook, you know, for, for Grandma's name, and uh, right. I just scroll. With yeah. Grandma. Today we have Grandma and Grandpa, and Uncle Kevin and Uncle Johnny over for some dinner. Here's Dad and Kyle and Uncle John. What are you doing? Yeah, what are you doing? I thought you were doing the. Uh, when did you start this? There's me. Should I do it? Give me the. Um, I'll do it. I don't get to get out there. It's got to charge up now. I'm about to do the VR headset, walk the plank. Just mom. 
Where's our garden? I just turned the tomato. Alright, I'm gonna have a berry from the bush. So if I die... Raspberry. It's all on spot. Mmm, <laughs> nice and juicy. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that one is a lot better. I had a red one. It was very tart. Is that right? Mom and I are at Hickory Creek. Hickory Creek Nature Preserve. On this beautiful 85 degree weather. Mm. There it is. Oh, so recording. So mom's hands are so they're getting so fat. She can't take get a ring ring off her finger. I don't know if you can tell. Working at the car wash. Get those bugs. 